Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. So in today's video, we're going to learn how to perform search operation on any given website. For this video, I'm going to consider the website YouTube. For that, we just need to create a new class file and name it whatever you want. For this video, I'm just going to name it search YouTube as I'm going to perform search operation on YouTube. So and for any automation you have to do a certain setup all the setup has been explained to you in the previous video so if you have not been following us just go back and check that video it will really be helpful i'll attach the link in the description box if you want for now i'm just going to continue and write driver dot get the url of the website i want to get so basically the dot get function gets the url so I'm just going to go ahead and write www.youtube.com and let's just run this and see. So to perform search operation, you need to fill the values. So uh, we're going to use inspect element for that. It will give us the unique identifier value and that can be used in the process of finding the element. So for that, I'm going to use inspect element and the shortcut for that is control shift I. Uh, once I'll just change the doc side view. Uh, it's just that I feel more comfortable using this view. And I'm just going to go ahead and click here. And you can take any attribute which you find unique. For this particular case, I'm going to go ahead with the name value and I'm just going to copy it. And now I'm going to write driver dot find so now you have a lot of options but since i have taken the name so i'm going to go with find element by name and i'm just going to fill the value whichever i have copied and now i have to so the function to fill a form is using send key so i'm just going to go ahead and write send keys and since i'm making a video on my channel so i'm just going to go ahead and open my channel Oh, I would really appreciate if you do the same and maybe like and subscribe while you have just opened that channel. So now we have just filled the column, but you have not essentially clicked on the search button. So for that, again, we're going to go to that particular browser and just going to inspect this element and for this time i'm just going to go ahead with the id attribute so now i'm going to just do driver dot find element by this time i'm going to go ahead with id and i'm going to write the id and the function to click a button is dot click so i'm just going to do that and I think we are pretty much done for the coding part. So let's just run and see how this works. So the website is loading. So once it's done loading, it will search for concepts made simpler. So now you can go ahead and click on the subscribe button if you really like this video and thank you for watching this video. Subscribe and press the bell icon to get notification for our latest videos.